Ready, Stella? Just leaving the uh, Silver Bay Trailhead. We're going to Bean and Bear Lake Lookout. It's supposed to be a medium difficulty trail. Two and a half miles out, two and a half back, or three roughly, somewhere in that range. So, yeah. Let's do it. You gotta go that way. Stella's getting a ride. This is a long hike for her. So far, this is an exceptionally vertical uh, hike. Now we're going straight down. Over, oh, that's where our goal is? We decided to turn around. We're not super far into the hike yet. Stella is a little more overheated, a little quicker than we were thinking this time around. It's hotter than average today. Another reason we're heading back is one, obviously her safety and health. Uh, Frenchies in particular are not super great at regulating their body temperature. And we were kind of anticipating that this trail is gonna be um, more in the shade, kind of like our one yesterday was. And it turns out it's the complete opposite. We will uh, come back a little later and do the full trail. <laughs> Gotta help the turtle cross the road so he doesn't get smushed. Oh, you're so fast. Oh, let me help you. Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know why you want to go this way. There you go. Seriously? This is not the way to go. Don't go that way. Go that way. See? See this water? Oh, isn't that nice? Okay. Bye. Take three. First time we came, we realized we forgot the sunscreen. So we went back and we got the sunscreen. Second time we got a mile in. Then realized that was not Stella's jam. So we went back and dropped Stella off and changed into shorts because it's hot. We all have been doing this today. <laughs> yesterday was cold, today is hot. Yes, it's typical Minnesota weather. So, take three. Let's hope for the best this time that we don't have to do a take four. We're not doing take four. No. So we were already a mile and a half in already. We're going all the way over there. There is 400 feet of elevation change. 400 feet? Yeah. Oh, is that all? I feel a little tricked. A nice thing about hiking this time of year is that there are very minimal bugs, if any, which is right up our alley. <laughs> if I fall and break my ankle, don't wonder why. Going straight up. Almost straight up. Right. Oh boy. Two hand of Oh my god. I just keep going. Oh, I hate this. It's awesome. This is great. This is what you needed? This is my fix right here, yeah. Oh. So we were talking earlier. And if you've ever heard of the, well, I'm sure you've heard of the channel, Switch It Up, YouTube channel. And Todd and Sheila like to go on hikes, but they like to go on different types of hikes. Lucas is gonna go on a hike with Sheila because he likes to make things as difficult as possible. I'm gonna go on a hike with Todd because I wanna enjoy my time <laughs> instead of struggling. Halfway. Ish, we think. Halfway ish. Yay. Well, it started on the back side of that hill over there. Oh. So we came up, down, through the valley here, and then I came back up here. Yeah, because we're parking lot's over by that tower. I don't know if you can see that red dot the over there, that's the tower. The trail goes on and on forever. It'll just go all the way up the whole coast, all the way to Canada. Holy. It's, like, it's like miles and miles. So how do you know when to stop? We're going to a destination. We're going to the lake. Which way are we supposed to go? Well, that's beautiful. Three miles in. We're not there yet. Google lied, said we were gonna be there in two and a half miles. We're not there. Well, you make that look so exceptionally easy. That's where we're going. We're just gonna go this first lake here because there's an overlook that looks it. Does it so, tell us where we are? Right there. Where the screw is? Where the screw is. Are we actually almost there? I don't know, the sign <laughs> says it now. Oh good, uphill! Okay. Alright, 
right, so we made it to Bean Lake Overview and did not disappoint. It's it's amazing. It's a lake in the middle of nowhere, a couple hundred feet down, cliffs. How do you? Yeah, I, I'll enjoy them from a, a little less cliffy area. Lucas gets right on out there. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, uh, it was a little further like the end than we expected, but yes. I think it's worth it. <gasps> Oh my god, it's a bee, it's a bee, it's a bee. I did not overreact, it was a bee and I'm allergic to bees. Other than she ran towards the cliff. Well. <laughs> Where are you going to go? No Nowhere. one said that panic uh, induces logic and reason, so. <laughs> it was a little further. It was a definitely more aggressive trail than I expected. Yes. Which I enjoyed. Christine did not quite so enjoy. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. Yeah. Well, we made it, and uh, I think it's worth it. It's pretty cool. It is really pretty you, up here. If you, if you know the things going into it, it's worth it. Bring some water, bring some snacks. Yes, that's important. <laughs> Eat lunch out here, because it's a few hours out, a few hours back. Yeah, so. for sure. And now we're going to start trucking back. Yes, we are. <laughs> here we go. Woo.